Hi YouTube, how are you doing and welcome back to Phasmophobia. In this video, we have something very exciting to talk about because the developers just announced a new ghost app that's going to come to Phasmophobia in the Christmas update and this one looks amazing. It looks like a copycat ghost that can copy traits and behaviors of other ghosts, which sounds amazing. I cannot wait to get my hands on this one as well as all the other stuff in the Christmas update. In this video, we're going to go over the teaser as well as some other secret stuff that's hidden in this screenshot. Uh, let's hop into it. So first off, uh, the name. The is once again included in the name, whereas every other ghost is just a ghost name, only the twins and this ghost will have the in their name. Now, the name itself is very hard to read. It looks like the first letter is either an X or a K, so like a, a xenomorph, but the name is not long enough at all for that, so I'm not entirely sure what the name would be. I am very unfamiliar with the ghost lore and ghost names and stuff like that, so maybe you guys can help me out with this one. But then the real stuff starts the xeno whatever it is is an elusive mysterious copycat ghost that copies traits and behaviors from other blank ghost types it's gonna copy behavior from other ghost type which sounds awesome i wonder how this is gonna work this could i this could work in a multitude of ways it could be that it can switch behaviors throughout the game so one time it does a poltergeist explosion then it shows up as a phantom and it disappears when you take a photo and then during a hunt it's a revenant or a right or something crazy or it could be a little bit more simple and easier to manage where it basically picks one other ghost at the start of a game and it will copy that ghost's behaviors uh maybe that would be the more easier way and the more secret way if it just starts doing crazy stuff left and right it would probably be easy to tell but also be absolutely amazing so I'm kind of hoping it'll just be like everything at once that'd be so cool uh but yeah that is the main thing that i'm excited for there's also the strength and the weakness which we should also take a look at but they're really hard to read especially the strength is very hard to read and the weakness is uh kind of very interesting uh that's uh, so the weakness is uh, several reports have noted ghost orb sightings and then something that is just smooshed out completely. So, the, the, first of all, this ghost does not have ghost orbs. It is not a ghost orb ghost. So I don't know what this means. Does this mean that this ghost have four evidences? Basically, that would be not a weakness at all that will be a strength for sure of course if you find all the four evidences and you're like wait a minute there's only one ghost that has four evidences then it's gonna be obvious or if you find contradictory evidence but having four evidences is not a weakness so i'm kind of hoping that's not it because that sounds crazy imagine nightmare mode nightmare mode with this guy i guess if you get three evidences on nightmare mode then it's also obvious so maybe it's not that bad but that sounds insane if they actually give this ghost ghost orbs uh, without it being ghost orbs evidence. That would be very interesting. Let me know what you think about that. I think it would be kind of too strong because it would put you on the wrong foot right away, especially as a weakness. If it was a strength, all right. But if it's a weakness, that's a... I mean, I guess it gives it away. But yeah. All right. The strength. The strength is extremely hard to read. It is super, super, super smushed out. It just says... Blah, 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 blah. Be careful. <laughs> That's terrifying. I I would love to hear what you guys think this could say. I see ghost here. See ghost. It is just off. It is so smudged. I cannot. I, I can't really make up anything here. And there's also nothing to go off. Maybe this strength refers back to the what, what it says here at the top where the ghost can copy other ghosts. Maybe that's the strength as well. But I don't know why they'd have to be so secretive about this because this is super smushed. But yeah, I'm very curious what this would be. This ghost is going to have as evidence spirit box, fingerprints, freezing temperatures. So once again, a freezing temp spirit box ghost, which are now only on Rio and the twins. So if you get fingerprint or if you get spirit box and freezing temps, it's now going to be three options with this ghost included uh, and then fingerprints is going to be the deciding one for this one so that is awesome that this sounds super cool i can't wait to see this could go a multitude of ways as i said i'm very hopeful it might be the crazy one where it can basically be anything that would be exciting 
But on top of that, we have another interesting thing in this screenshot, which is the items tab over here. I wonder what that's going to be, because uh, this is not in the this is not in the journal right now. Uh, the items tab. I wonder if this is going to just simply show the items you have brought in the game or it's going to show some of the cursed possessions that are available in this quest, uh, because we were theorizing that if you have all the cursed possessions, which they have teased, if you want to see those, I've made videos about all the uh, things that they've teased that they're going to teased that they are are gonna add which is the voodoo doll which can force interactions uh, a summoning circle that can force the ghost to spawn for a ghost photo and then a music box which can help you find the ghost room uh, if all those are gonna be available every game it might be extremely easy so maybe this items tab refers to which of those you can find on the map or which of those uh, you have taken with you. I'm not entirely sure, but I hope it's going to be the former where it, it limits the amount of those you have available and it tells you here which ones you have. That sounds super cool. This update is looking amazing. Uh, last time, they teased two ghost types and we got four. Uh, we have gotten our first teaser of a new ghost, which is, by by the way, this is an extra bonus thing that they're adding to the, to the update. This is not like part of the cursed items, obviously. It's a ghost. I am very excited. This sounds amazing. I can't wait to find this one in the game uh let me know what you think i hope you enjoy uh if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it, dislike it we're gonna be going live uh pretty soon after this video goes up so you're very welcome to join us over on twitch thank you so much for watching i love you and i'll see you in the next one bye bye guys bye bye